There's a one-eyed, yellow-eyed idol to the north of Kathmandu. There's a little marble cross below the town. There's a broken-hearted woman tends the grave of Mad Karu, and the yellow god forever gazes down. He was known as Mad Karu by the subs at Kathmandu. He was hotter than they felt inclined to tell. But for all his foolish pranks, he was worshipped in the ranks, and the colonel's daughter smiled on him as well. He had loved her all along, with a passion of the strong. The fact that she loved him was plain to all. She was nearly twenty-one, and arrangements had begun to celebrate her birthday with a ball. He wrote to ask what present she would like from Mad Karu. They met next day as he dismissed the squad. And jestingly she told him then that nothing else would do than the green eye of the little yellow god. On the night before the dance, Mad Karu seemed in a trance. They chaffed him as they puffed on their cigars. But for once he failed to smile and he sat alone a while and went out into the night beneath the stars. He returned before the dawn with his shirt and tunic torn and a gash across his temple dripping red. They patched him right away, and they slept through all the day, and the colonel's daughter watched beside his bed. He woke at last and asked if they would send his tunic through. She brought it, and he thanked her with a nod. He bade her search the pockets, saying, That's from Mad Karu, and she found the little green eye of the god. She upbraided Mad Karu in the way that women do, though both her eyes were strangely hot and wet. But she wouldn't take the stone, and Mad Karu was left alone with the jewel that he chanced his life to get. When the ball was at its height, in that still and tropic night, she thought of him and hurried to his room. As she crossed the barrack square, she could hear the dreamy air of a waltz tune softly stealing through the gloom. His door was open wide, with silver moonlight shining through. The place was wet and slippery where she trod. An ugly knife lay buried in the heart of Mad Karu, it was the vengeance of the little yellow god. There's a one-eyed yellow idol to the north of Kathmandu. There's a little marble cross below the town. There's a broken-hearted woman tends the grave of Mad Karoo, and the yellow god forever gazes.